So since everyone's out here, I'd like to have a little conversation. Last night, I couldn't figure out why your speech was the way it was. Is there a reason you went to Beth this morning and told her that I'm all fired up? Because you were. Why did you have to lie about throwing my name under the bus? How did I lie? You came into the OLG room and you said, Vic, I want you to know I'm only clean campaigning. Which I did. You never threw my name under the bus? What did you say to her last night? Yeah, I said I was coming for you guys, but was I sitting on my bed twiddling my thumbs talking to myself? I said to you, are you and Brayden going after big targets? You said yes. This was two days ago. I said to you guys before the invisible HOH comp, guys, if anyone wins, who's going up? Is Beth going up? Yup, yup, yup. Not a nah. chance. Not okay. a chance. All right. That is All false. Right. That is All false. Right. I've never you brought up a conversation. You pulled me into the ball pit, begging for Austin no, to stay. No, what, what are you talking about? About Austin, I'm Why talking you about. Why people that I'm trying to flip the vote? Oh my Brady? God! You're telling me that you didn't pull me into the ball pit not to a try chance. and get off. Ah, not you're a chance. Insane, bro. Victoria's not lying. We did talk in the ball pit about potentially flipping the vote on Brayden. However, she's totally misrepresenting that conversation. Damn. You were HOH. Why would I try to get you to flip the vote? Because at that point, you thought it was tied. Yep, you kept saying it was tied. Yeah, I did, because I didn't want people to know it's me. It's an invisible HOH. So you're admitting you're the invisible HOH? Yes. OK, so why were you making it look like tie? You specifically were telling everybody that you thought it was Ty and everybody knew it was you, Vic. Okay, I know that people knew it was me. I'm not an idiot. Do the numbers. You got caught playing both sides hard. I have not! I never said a word about you guys. When I told you guys that I wasn't going to throw you guys under the bus, I didn't. And now I'm sitting on the boat because of it. I didn't say a word to Beth about you guys. Not a word. I told you guys I wasn't going to and I didn't. And that's why I'm so hurt because I believed you guys that you weren't throwing me under the bus. You've been tossing my name as well. I know you've been talking about me. It's an eye for an eye. I'm yeah, not, but not, I'm not the way you here. did. I never once I told Beth what to do with her HOH. I swear to God. Beth, why do you think I'm a liar and a manipulator? What makes you think that? I was told. <laughs> we all were in agreement that we were going after them. Like, I don't know why you guys are lying. Hold on, so are we suggesting that Vic led all these conversations and, and there were no other active participants? Yeah, I just brought it up every single night by myself. I think that's my own, that, that would be my only question. Do you want me to start throwing shade? Is this how we're playing? Okay. When you won HOH, you started an alliance, called the oddballs. I wasn't even- I never started I that alliance! In, I wasn't even in the you room! The, you oh my god! You guys are Name. I came in the room and you were like, guess what? It has a name. You literally made that name. I did not make up the name Oddball. You told me it. You said, guess what? We have a name. No, I didn't. Okay. I would never come up with a name that stupid. What was the point of the Oddball? What was the point? You said you to get these guys out. Yeah, you I have a question. Me? Who are the Oddballs? These two. Austin, Brayden, me, and Brohan and Kyle. Seven dude. We literally had an alliance to come for you guys, and they're denying it. I have the power to put you guys up. If I put you guys up, one of you guys would not be here right now.